we call them co-interior angles. So here is another geometric fact you must add to your bank of knowledge. Co-interior angles sum to 180 degrees. I repeat, co-interior angles sum to 180 degrees. Now, many years ago, when I was your age, we used to call these supplementary angles. So just in case you see it anywhere, don't get confused. They mean the same thing. We used to call them supplementary angles. But now you should know that it's called co-interior angles. Here is another question. We've been told that GH and IJ are parallel line segments. A and B are of the ratio 1, ratio 3. So what this is telling us is that angle B is three times bigger than angle A. Now, if you think about it, there are different ways to answer this. But one way is by using the bar model. So we know that these are co-interior angles right? So it means they should actually sum to 180 degrees. So altogether, thinking about this as boxes, we actually have, using our bar model, all right, A and B adding up to be four parts. Now, this four parts is equal to 180 degrees, which means each of these parts should be 45 degrees. So it means A is 45 degrees and B is three lots of A, which is 135 degrees. 